Hello guys, welcome back. I hope everyone is doing great. Okay guys, so you may remember that two weeks ago I told you that last week we we're gonna have our summative assessment. That had to change a little bit with the change of schedules. So the work that you guys choose to do this week is gonna be graded as your summative assessment. So you guys get to choose which one you do. Just remember the main concept, the key concept of our unit. In this case, we've been talking about change because pop art really came to change the art world. Remember that pop art is about making art that can be understood by everyone. We do that by taking inspiration from popular culture. So as long as your artwork takes inspiration from something that belongs in popular culture, then you're totally fine. To get inspired for this project, we're going to talk about Richard Hamilton. Hamilton was from Britain and he was a painter, but he's very well known for his collages too. So you may wonder, how is Richard Hamilton considered a pop art artist? And the thing is that he is one of the first artists that started telling people that art should be made for everyone. Art should be accessible for all different types of people. So his approach to painting and the topics of his collages are what makes him a pop-up artist. He's actually considered the father or the godfather of pop art, which means that he was a pioneer. He was one of the first people that started with pop art. So as you can see, his collages are very fun. He uses lots of different pieces and also sometimes he uses paint. Take a look at the faces because we're going to do something similar today. Okay, so for today what you guys are going to do is a collage. You will see that my example is with the face and that I use watercolors. But remember that you guys can use whatever materials you have available at home. It doesn't have to be the exact same that I'm using. And also, if you want to do a collage about something else, that's totally fine too. It does not have to be a face. Remember to send me a photo of your final artwork. Yes, this is very important because this is your summative assessment. Okay, guys, that's it. Remember that if you have any questions or comments, please let me know. I'll be glad to help you. Remember, you can contact me through Google Classroom, my email, or Google Hangouts, whichever works best for you. Okay, guys, that's it. Bye-bye. Take care. Stay safe.